ensuring extra range for 2022 Volvo XC40 by new software update. The EPA-rated range number goes from 208 to 223 miles, and Volvo says a software update will provide the extra miles for existing 2021 models as well. One second before we start the video, kindly subscribe to this channel. That will motivate us to make more videos like this. Your support is very important for us. Only, you can help us to reach the next milestone. Now, let's get started. Volvo is boosting the range of its electric small SUV, the XC40 Recharge. The 2022 model now goes 223 miles on a charge, according to the EPA, up from 208 miles. Volvo also says that a software update will soon be available for existing 2021 models that will provide the same boost. Volvo has made some updates to the XC40 Recharge's powertrain for 2022 that result in an extra 15 miles of EPA-rated range. The electric SUV is now estimated to deliver 223 miles on a single charge, and existing owners of 2021 XC40 Recharge models will also be able to get the extra range via a forthcoming software update. The EPA combined efficiency figure also rises from 79 MPGO to 85 MPGO. The updates are not to the physical battery pack itself, but rather entail a number of small software changes focused on energy management and thermal management, a Volvo spokesperson told C-D. These updates helped the 2022 XC40 recharge perform better when the EPA retested it for the new model year. The EPA has not yet rated the XC40's sibling, the C40 recharge, but we expect it to achieve a similar estimate as the 2022 model. We're curious to see how the range improvement plays out in the real world, and we'll update this article with test results for a 2022 model as soon as we are able to complete our 75 miles per hour real-world highway range test. In that test, a 2021 model achieved a real-world range of 180 miles. The 2022 XC40 recharge starts at $56,395 for the standard model and $59,245 for the ultimate model. That's a $1,310 increase in base price compared with the 2021 model. 2022 models are at dealerships now, and Volvo says it will release information soon about the software updates for existing 2021 models. What do you think about this? Let me know this by commenting below. I would love to see them. I can go through your comments and share my feedback. Thanks for watching this video completely. Kindly subscribe to this channel and hit the like button. Thanks again, have a great day.